you'll see a lot of wound packers want to put a little circle on and push that down in there. The, the key is to continually hold pressure. So I'm going with this before I get it, whether I wrap it or whether I just go straight, I want to push that in before I pull this one out. Push that in and I'm going around the world, so to speak, circumferentially around this wound cavity, trying to pack to all parts of it. Again, keeping pressure before I insert my next finger. Again, finger over finger like that. Trying to make this go around the world. Now, one thing I didn't tell you is when you first start packing, you can just take this Z-pack and drop it down your shirt and it's going to unfold and be out of the way. So yes, thanks for keeping the blood going. So I'm going around the world, making sure I'm getting all the voids in this cavity. Again, finger over finger. So if I, if I pull this finger out and get this one, then my bleeder is going to occur again. So I want to make sure I hold pressure before I push the next one in and do that exchange. Once I've packed it, if I still have room in the cavity, I'm going to need more gauze. Otherwise, I take what was left, put it on top, and start my three minutes of pressure. I tell all my students four because I know if I tell them four, they'll probably give me three. It's a long time to hold three minutes. So what you don't want to do is this because your fingers are going to get really sore over three minutes. So there we have it. And so I can remove this. Um, we should see some clots down in here. Uh, a little bit. Yep, there we are. We're getting some clotting there. So what, we'll, what we don't want to see is candy striping on our wound gauze as we pull it out. Because that means we weren't, yeah, there's our clots coming out now. So that means we weren't effective. This was pushed down in there, had that you know, a couple minutes of reaction time to react with the blood, just like a real hemostatic gauze would. So I just drop that in there, feel my gloves inside out, take those there, drop it in, and it's time for the next student.